you guys welcome back to another vlog you guys it is monday may the 2nd it's the first monday of a new month so i said why not just start off with a new vlog okay um i just bought some new pillows from the at home store um because i was trying to decorate my living room for the spring and get it you know spring light um so i kept the same colors that's right i kept the same colors um teal and kind of like teals and greens because i didn't want to switch up too much but i did need some new pillows um a, a lot of y'all asked me questions about my sofa my sectional and where it's from um it is from ashley furniture um i believe it comes in another shade i got it in the color gray but i believe it also comes in like a beige or cream and with a four-year-old i cannot have anything white cream beige nothing in my house okay so um yeah but it is from ashley furniture but on this vlog, I just want to catch up to speed, you know, let y'all know what's been going on. The month of May is going to be a busy month for me, for my family, for all of us. Um, but let me just show y'all real quick what I got in the mail from Amazon. Um, I love, I love scents, y'all. I love scents. I love my house smelling good, fresh. So let me just show y'all some of the scents I got. All right, y'all. So I hope that's good enough light. Um, so... I put most of my scents and my smell goods and my plugins. I put them all in this basket that I got from the at home store as well. Um, from Amazon though, I know you can get these from Bath and Body Works, but I just ordered these from Amazon. I ended up getting some beautiful wallflowers. I got cinnamon spice vanilla, which smells so good. It smells so good. And I got four. And then I also ended up getting one that's called lavender vanilla. Um, which I haven't had this before and I also got a set of four of these I'm still waiting for my um, the actual wallflower plugins to get here I ordered those from Amazon as well I just ordered them from Amazon because you know with Amazon Prime you get something the next day and I don't like waiting so I can't wait to use those and then also I end up getting some um, some more home decor from the at home store as well which I'll show y'all in a minute but it's kind of hard because Casey's in there watching cartoons and I don't want to get uh, copyrighted for, you know, the cartoons playing in the background. But yeah, so that is that. Also, y'all, like I said, the month of May is going to be really busy for me. So I'm going to try to stick with my vlogging schedule, like uploading a video every week. But it's been so busy. I do want to tell y'all, though, that like two weeks ago, I got accepted into the Facebook Reels program and the instagram reels program within the same week so now i get paid for my instagram reels and facebook reels and um i can't really tell y'all if there was like any real criteria for joining you just have to be invited so i really can't tell you much information on how to get accepted but what i do know is just keep pushing out those reels okay because you know you really can't you really can't expect you know anything until you like actually just do it just do it i know a lot of you guys were saying you know how do you start um how you know don't i don't have the right camera all these excuses for real just start pushing out reels i think that's one step just push out reels um it don't have to be anything extravagant you don't have to be using all these crazy transitions um i started just doing reels basically on things that i do every day if you look if you follow me on instagram you don't need to go ahead and follow me but if you look at my instagram like my reels from like a while back i was recording videos based on things i was doing you know already so a lot of my reels would be like what i'm doing around the house just showing a video of me cleaning up um i'll do some funny like um lip syncing videos you know because i am really a goofball but um other than that you don't really have to do anything anything fancy just starting off i definitely don't recommend it but if you do want to try some transitions start with before and after um and then i use cap cut which is a great beginner friendly phone app that you can use to like add your transition you can add some text you know if you want to get a little fancy but that's all i use y'all so um like i said i got accepted in the same week uh facebook i got into may 19th and i think the goal was 375 dollars i'll try to screen put the screen somewhere put the screenshot somewhere on the screen and then for instagram um the goal is 8500 until may 19th so they give you a cap that you can reach but i do feel like 
of course, I feel like they're paying influencers and creators. I feel like they're paying us more because they want to keep us on the app. And I do feel like they want us to work harder. I feel like they want us to push out these, it's an incentive to push out more videos, to get people watching. But I really feel like you're actually just helping the app out. So for me, I have been taking breaks as needed because y'all, if you get lost on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, social media, it can be draining. And there's a whole nother life outside of social media. And, you know, so for me, I got to take my breaks, you know, um, you know, and there's nothing wrong with that. So take your breaks as needed because you would get caught up and trying to keep up with the next person or what this person is doing. You have to, you know, go at your own pace. And that's about the best advice I can give you. Go at your own pace. You don't have to do what Susie's doing or Derek's doing. Just do what you want to do at your own pace. And um, because... I'm a mother. I got kids. We got graduations coming up. It's so much coming up in the month of May. And y'all, I've been like going MIA a couple of times. And I know that my true subscribers and my true followers understand because most of my followers are women like me, mothers like me, who are in the same predicament. So yeah, take your breaks as needed. All right. So I'm going to take y'all to the living room and show y'all my planter I got from that home store. And you guys, I end up doing a... Um, a DIY. I ended up spray painting my candle holders gold to kind of match the decor in my living room. Um, but let me just show y'all because I can be long winded. Let me just show y'all. <laughs> All right, guys. So this is the planter that I got from the at home store. Um, yeah, it was. They had different ones. They had different sizes, but I chose this size. You can actually use it as a planter, or it could be like a stand. Um, this plant, this beautiful palm plant, was also from the at home store, and it still has a tag on it. <laughs> um, I love plants like this because it just reminds me of somewhere tropic and relaxing. So uh, what I plan on doing is stuffing the planter with some towels and then I'm going to go around the top of the planter with some um, fake grass, which is this stuff right here. I've seen a girl do this on a reel and I said, you know what, I'm going to try that. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And then this is what I DIY, y'all. <laughs> So I ended up spray painting these uh, candle holders. They were black at first, but I wanted some type of gold accent pieces. So I spray painted the candle holders. I also spray painted the picture frames and that vase. Um, I don't know. It was just something to do. I didn't want to go out and buy more home decor items because I had a lot of stuff stored in my basement already. So that's what I did. And yeah, so there was a picture right there um, that I took down. We're gonna put that picture up on that wall. And then let me go over here where the ladder is and show y'all what we're doing now. And we had a bigger picture up there, but we didn't like it. So we ended up taking it down and we ended up putting that picture up. So we're just kind of rearranging stuff like we do as normal. <laughs> But I like this one right here. This picture was actually from Ross. And I think it goes so well with my pillows and the, you know, the colors that I have already in my uh, living room area. So, but I definitely need something to go on that wall now. Which I'll probably end up getting like a mirror or something from that home store because every time I go there, I find something. So I don't know, it'll probably be maybe next weekend because this weekend I'm going to be in Virginia. So yeah, so that's what I've did so far around my living room area. I'm just trying to spruce it up for the spring, like I said. And maybe I'll show y'all the new um, the new lights to the fence. Well, if you've been following my Instagram, you already seen the night view. My husband put lights around each post of the fence and it looks really pretty at night. It's very lit up, very pretty. So maybe I will show y'all um, later on tonight so y'all can see uh, how it looks at night when it's all lit up. just wanted to show you guys my fence um 
now that they finished painting it and stuff like that so let me just show y'all really quick how the fence looks um, as you can see there's a shed is like burnt orange and black yeah and uh, my husband's already in the process of getting our grass to grow <laughs> so don't worry about the little dirt spots you see but yeah that's how it looks right now yeah so I have to go get ready to pick up the twins and yeah I think I'm going to attend this vlog on tomorrow so let me go pick these boys up from school I just got off work and I got a package. I got a package. So, y'all, yeah, I always get excited when I get packages. I don't even know what this is for real. This ain't Am this is not Amazon, but we about to find out. Oh, you know what? I, I think it's my hair. But um, let me just show y'all how the living room looks. I'm gonna just show y'all real quick how the living room looks. Hopefully, I can get something with this bright light. Okay, let me get somewhere with this good lighting. All right, so I'm gonna show y'all how the picture looks up because I don't think I showed y'all how it looks now that it's up. Hey, yo, give me, give me, give me. Rashawn, yeah, I'm gonna get them crackety crack toes. What's good, you two? It's they can't see because yeah. it's too dark up there. You gotta come out here. Oh, wait a second, I got you. That's how it looks now that the picture is on the wall. And then on that wall, I'm thinking about getting a mirror or something. Um, my husband patched up the holes that we had up there. Yes, Casey. What you got to tell me something? What you got to tell me, Casey? What happened? You stinky. I just got in the house. Like, I just got home. This is what I do with every day. This is every day. Jaden, what, what are you doing? Huh? Uh, the case deflated his thing. He deflated his thing, so you got it around your neck because... I was carrying Where are the balls that go inside? Y'all, this is... Case, you made it... Y'all, let me, let me get myself together. I'll be right back. All right, you guys. Whew. That whole episode was like, tell me you a mom without telling me you a mom. I'm talking about as soon as I get in the dough. Mom with this, mom with that. Y'all, this is every day. But I just want to come and show y'all real quick what I got in the mail. So the first package I already opened because I was so excited. So Case is graduating from pre-K. So he needed a cute uh, top and a bow tie, a dress outfit. He wears a size four. So I got this cute little set from Amazon. Here it is, it comes with a little bow tie, which I think is so cute. And then it also comes with the suspenders, which is so cute. And then it also comes with the plaid dress pants. Ain't this so cute, you guys? I cannot wait for him to put this on for his little gradu graduation from preschool. He's gonna be so cute. And so, yeah, so I got that because for whatever reason, it's hard for me trying to find things, um, specific things for boys. If y'all have boys, you know what I mean. It's kind of hard trying to shop for boys. For girls, you can like find stuff everywhere. You can shop anywhere for girls. But for boys, I find it like really hard to find stuff, especially if you're looking for something specific, you know. So that is that. And then from Amazon. So you remember I told you I ended up getting some wallflowers, the scents. So now the actual plugins came in the mail, the wallflower plugins. And um, you guys know how these work. If you shop at Bath and Body Works, you've seen these plenty of times. They got different shapes and different designs and different um, you know types to choose from. And this is how they look. You just plug it into the wall, you put the oil scent, you screw the oil scent here, and these smell so good. So I got one, two, three four five six so I got six of them so yeah that's that and then I think this is my hair y'all so I end up ordering some bundles because I'm about to take these braids out 
and um because like i said the month of may is gonna be very busy i got cases preschool graduation i got the twins graduating from middle school um and then this month is also me and my husband's anniversary so i needed to have you know a nice little do so let me just open this i ended up ordering from this company that's actually here in atlanta um i think it's called uh undini care or udini care what is this oh okay okay you guys so i lied this is not the hair that i thought it was this is actually some um stuff that i got sent from a brand that i'm working with this will actually be the first reel that i do that's brand sponsored with this company they sent me some um nice stuff they 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 specialize in like underwear garments body shapers athletic wear for women um you guys the company name is called under outfit and you guys follow me on instagram so you see the reel that i do sponsoring the items they sent me so i'm super excited about this because again this is my first brand reel that i get to do on instagram um so yeah so that is that and their website is actually uh it's underoutfit.com and I end up getting what did I get oh so I end up getting a cami some leggings some boy shorts and a body shaper and y'all I'm just gonna, I'm gonna open it up because I want to show y'all a sneak pre, uh, peek of what it looks like so there's something like skims um their nude color this is the bra um that I got and then I also got a the boy shorts to match which is really cute and then i also got a tank and you guys feeling that feeling this right now i can tell you right now this is good quality just by the way it feels and i can tell this is going to be comfortable and it's going to be so durable because you know how you just can tell by the material that's how i feel about this right now um i also got this tank it's supposed to be a compression tank I'm um, supposed to give you a nice silhouette and for real like during the summertime you cannot have too many of these um, tanks because you can wear these with everything so every summer I end up buying more I usually go to like Walmart and buy my basics but um yeah so they sent me this and then they also sent me some leggings and I chose the leggings because these are the leggings with pockets on the side and this will be my first pair of leggings with the actual pockets on the side so I can't wait to wear these and i got these in a the size in medium they look a little big but we'll see because i'm a little i'm a little thick around the you know the thighs so we'll see how these fit but yeah so i'm excited to actually try these items on and uh, wear it in actual real you guys so i just want to show y'all real quick what i got in the mail and Hmm, I don't know if I'm going to actually show you guys how I do the reel. You know what? That'd be a good idea. I'll probably show you how I do the reel. I don't know. We'll see. Hey, you guys. I am back. Um, you guys, I'm actually in Virginia. I made it to my mom's house for Mother's Day. And it was just so hard trying to vlog when you're traveling with children. Hopefully, I'll get better at it. But I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this short vlog. And I hope you got something from it. Um, definitely stay tuned and subscribe for more vlogs from me. And also, if I don't talk to you guys before Mother's Day, I want to say happy Mother's Day to all my mothers. And definitely enjoy your day. All right? Until next time. Mwah. Bye, YouTube.